<laughs> it looks like I have to. <laughs> I'll tell you, I'll be right back. And we can ride the book and share that feel of love. I want to ride. Welcome back to another video. So we are dressed in our robe <laughs> and it's a different robe I might add. Isn't it so cute? I got it when I went to Cancun. Don't quote me on it. <laughs> I think it was Cancun, uh, Mexico with my, for my friend's um, 28th birthday child i'm all over the place i don't remember nothing but yeah but i got it when i went to my friend's uh birthday celebration in mexico but she's super cute she's all white and has my name on it it's a personal touch anyways um i'm going out tonight i haven't <laughs> i'm going out to a club like a party um with my best friend Brittany. um I haven't gone out to like a club since December, since her birthday in December. And so I'm a little rusty. So I got home from work, I took a nap. So, you know, that should like me being tired should be out the window, but we about, we gonna see how that really work out because once it's nighttime, nap or don't nap, I'm, I'm ready to go to sleep, but we gonna put out positive vibes that we gonna stay up and that we gonna get through tonight. Um, it starts at eleven. It's ten thirty nine, <laughs> and once again, I live an hour away from all of my friends, so my goal is to be out of the house by eleven thirty. So this video will be you guys watching me get ready. It's not a tutorial. It's not none of that. It's just simply y'all just <sighs> watching me. What is that? Oh. <laughs> sorry guys i got distracted but this is not a tutorial this is not nothing education wise this is just simply y'all watching me get ready to go out tonight so what's on the agenda is um makeup um i have to find something to wear i kind of have a few um outfits in mind but we're gonna see how those actually play out when i put them on because you know you could think about an outfit and then when you put it on it's like not giving what you thought it was gonna give so yeah with the makeup though we're going to put on these lashes again being that i haven't been out in a while normally i would just pop on some mascara and call it a day but, you know, she's trying to pop out. So, I'm going to put those lashes on. I also um, have some knotless box braids in with, uh, well, bohemian because they got the little curly pieces. I'm trying to find one. Right. Got the little curly pieces in there. I'm going to have to refresh those with some mousse. But, I kind of want to add two curly pieces right here so i could do a little style where i could put the two curly pieces here and do a little half up half down situation or like a high bun situation but i still want something like a little curly piece hanging in the front so that's the plan that's the goal i have some leftover curly hair human curly hair that we used i have a crochet needle and I think that's all I'm going to need, right? I've never done this before. I've never crocheted before. So this is a first time. But once again, this is not a tutorial. This is just y'all just watching me maneuver through this thing. So first, I kind of want to get rid of the dryness on my face. Um, so I'm going to do my skincare now. As y'all can see, I don't know if y'all can see, but these two pimples right here is trying to take me out the game. They weren't here before I took a nap today. So I don't know where these came from, but <sighs> we'll discuss more about my skincare journey in another video because I do want to do like a skincare routine video. So I'll discuss more of my skincare journey 
and all the trials and tribulations I have been through with my skin. Um, yeah, in another video. So this is not the video for that. Okay, so we're going to let that dry down a bit before we put on the last thing, which is my moisturizer. Um, whenever I do makeup, I don't like to put on too much product because I'm going to put on makeup and I sweat. So too much product buildup makes me sweat even more, if that makes sense. So as free as it, I can keep my pores, the better for me. So I made myself some tea, y'all. Um, some ginger tea because I have some stomach issues where if I, like, I don't know, I notice, like, if I'm not, if I don't, um, if I don't drink my tea, I feel bloated and I am gassy where, like, I'm burping a lot. And we're not trying to have that tonight, so I made sure I bought myself some tea. So, yeah, I'm all over the place, but bear with me, y'all. So, this is, I just took a little bit out of the whole bundle, because we're just doing, we're literally just doing these two areas right here. Two little pieces, so I'm going to take some hair, like, about this much, and then... Um, y'all, bear with me. I've never done this before. I've seen the girlies do something. I wonder if I stick it through. Hold on, let's stick it through. it's not working out for me and I don't have time to sit and figure this out right now I thought if I put it through and knot it it would work so that didn't work because the hair is still very like <sighs> silky so tying a knot in it wouldn't work I know maybe if I had used like some sort of glue like maybe hair glue that'll help it stay but I don't have none of those things right now and I don't also don't have the time so we're gonna call that a fail once again like I mentioned in the beginning of this video this is not a tutorial as y'all can see because I don't be knowing what I'm doing sometimes um so we move okay I'm gonna do my edges so we could tie that down as we do our face so I'm gonna use my gummy yummy or gummy professional edge control or pomade put a little bit of that all over by the way i did a little mini pickup today too after work i went to ulta and walgreens and i picked up this is Walgreens. I picked up the false scara lashes. And in Ulta, I picked up the powder puff, which is too damn expensive, but we're not we're not even gonna we're not even gonna dig too deep in that. I picked up the e.l.f. um power grip primer, which is supposed to be similar to the milk grip primer. And I also picked up this um brow pen. It's like supposed to give you like hair-like strokes. Um, it's by the brand Revolution. And that's really all I bought, to be honest. So, yeah, but, yeah. So, to put these lashes on, I'm going to use this glue, which you guys have seen in my prior video of me putting on DIY lash extensions. If you haven't checked out that video, you can go ahead and do so. Um, yeah. So, I'm 
gonna start with this eye first. Okay, people, lashes are on. They look good. It'll come together once the makeup is done. But anyways, we're gonna move on to the brows. I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna use this brow pen that I got from, oh, from Makeup Revolution. That's what it looks like. It's supposed to give like hair-like strokes. So you probably gotta be like light on the hands like that. So we about to see. I've never used anything like this in my life. So let me bring y'all down a bit. Okay. My friend is probably watching this like, bitch, this is what's taking you so long. Or this will be taking you so long. And it's like, yes, yes. Unfortunately, it is what be taking me so long. <laughs> okay, so the ones in the front was a little too dark. So I just got a baby wipe and just wiped that off. And then I'm going to go on with my pencil because I just, even though I be liking how y'all girls do the hair-like stroke eyebrow fill-in situation, I'm also not used to it. So it gives like my eyebrows is not done. So I'm just going to go in with my pencil and just finish the job pretty much. I love how my makeup came out. It's giving. It's giving subtle glow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We move. So face is done. We're about to move on to what to wear. So I'm going to pick out a few options and then I'm going to come back. Okay, guys. So I put on a simple bodycon black dress. Um, Looks like this very simple regular only because i really don't have anything to wear and i also don't have the time to skim through my closet and try on everything and see what works and what doesn't work so this is what we're gonna go with it's a safe option and it definitely gives like club we are gonna dress it up with some accessories so i was thinking silver yeah silver so i'm gonna take these studs out and i'm gonna put in these silver half hoop like earrings that a lot of the girlies have been rocking these days i got it from this jewelry store in my local mall they had a whole bunch it came in a set actually but we're gonna rock these ones and they're also not heavy at all it feels super lightweight so we're gonna wear that um we're gonna put on silver watch
and that's pretty much it for jewelry i have my cross silver chain on so we're gonna let that show yeah something like that right and then shoes we're gonna put on these boots i've worn these boots before um i got them from eagle shoes i'll put the link in the bio but let me get some socks okay so for here i've been seeing a lot of girlies do this situation where maybe i should do it leave this in the front maybe i really wish i could have added that here right here but it's whatever i've been seeing some girlies do this thing where they go like this let's see if it's gonna look good on me Let's see. Trust the process, Monique. Trust the process. Something to that effect. Let me take off the headband and see the true vision. Ow. Ow. Okay half bad let me just smooth out these edges a bit so they don't look so paste on i mean y'all it don't look half bad i think that's how y'all be doing it <laughs> i'm gonna get some mousse and i'm gonna put it on the rest of the hair so that the curlies aren't so stiff looking and then i'm gonna come back and show y'all what it the final look of it okay so last but not least our lip okay y'all this is the final oh, i'm not in love with this but we're gonna stick to the process, y'all, and see how we like it. <laughs> I don't know. Anyways, this is the final look. The face is giving. Loving the face. And like I said, these two little pimples will not let me live. It is now 12 o'clock. I gotta go. Oh, let me show y'all the bag. So, the boots, they have have some white in it i don't know if y'all could tell but the front of the boots have white so i'm gonna bring this white bag to play off of the white in the boots yeah you have seen these boots plenty of times on um, my houston outfit haul situation and yeah, you guys have seen these boots before. So, yeah, it's the same boots. They have white in the front, so I'm just going to bring this white bag to play off of it. I'm going to pack that bag now with all my things. Really quickly, I forgot to mention the fragrance of the night. So, I had bought this replica um, Discovery set. So, in that set, I'm going to use By the Fireplace. It's very manly and tobacco-y like it literally smells like a man perfume or cologne um but i like it so i'm gonna use it and i'm also going to bring it with me to re-up on in case i need to which i doubt because it lasts all night but you just never know and yeah so that is it this is the outfit these are the boots it's giving it's giving simple yet classy and i love it oh my god okay guys thank you so much for watching this video please don't forget to like comment share 
and subscribe and i'm gonna head out now because i am super late but thank you guys so much for everything for the likes the comments all of it uh, we're finally in the 100 subscribers mark i know i think i'm at 102 right now so we got to keep bringing that up once again i appreciate you guys so much <laughs> but yeah so i will see y'all in the next video don't forget to leave some suggestions on what kind of videos you would like to see next because i'm starting to run out of ideas and that's not good because we just getting started so put in the suggestion box some some things that you guys will be interested in seeing from me doing any type of content it doesn't matter what it is just put it in the comments and yeah so i'm out bye guys <laughs>